Hi there, hope you're having a great day. Speaking of great days, it was a great day when I heard that blend modes were coming to ArcGIS Online. Now here is the ArcGIS Online Map Viewer Beta. If you're curious about how to get to the Map Viewer Beta, just click on this series of dots and choose Map Viewer Beta in ArcGIS Online. And check it out, it's worth a look. Here is just the default map view, and I'm going to pull in an imagery base map. So, imagery. And on top of that, I'll add a layer called the Earth at Night from NASA, beautiful NASA content. So you can access that via the Living Atlas. It's been tiled up for you if you like. And I'll search for Earth at Night. And there it is, 2016. We'll just add this to our map. Okay, so effectively this is a nighttime look at our planet compared to the daytime look at our planet, right? So this is daytime, this is nighttime. And when you zoom in on this Earth at night imagery, I mean, it's, it's capturing all the light of our cities and other light emitting accoutrement of life on Earth. And you get this big glow effect, kind of like looking into the headlights of humankind. Um, and that's cool and everything, it's beautiful, but what if you wanted to actually see Chicago? You're staring at a light bulb. Well, let's try some blend modes. Okay, so for this Earth at Night imagery, I'll select it and I'll open its properties over here. Now there's this glorious, glorious category called blending. And by default, it's just normal. And normal just means the layer that's on top is what you see. Technically, that's a blend mode. It's just the default easiest blend mode. But there are so many other cool blend modes. Let's do a blend mode called overlay. So overlay will use the lightness and darkness to control what you see underneath this image. So if it's light, you'll see through to the underlying imagery. If it's dark, uh, it will kind of darken it. Well, makes sense, right? Let's see what it looks like. Overlay. And immediately we see something pretty interesting. Let me get rid of this. Now we're looking at a nighttime earth, but instead of staring into the light bulb, the nighttime illumination layer is really just revealing sort of etch-a-sketch style the daytime imagery underneath. Isn't that interesting? And places where it's dark at night is darkened. So this is a really interesting coupling using the overlay blend mode in the ArcGIS Online Beta Map Viewer. There's Detroit. And if we zoom out, let's get like a, a top of world, as they say, perspective. It still actually looks kind of nighttime. But instead of just washed out areas, you know, you can actually see Atlanta now instead of Atlanta just looking like a white hot light bulb at night. Isn't that cool? Let's do a quick tour. Hey, while I'm at it, see how when I zoomed out, you saw a white background? That's always driven me insane. So one of the cool new features of the beta map viewer is the addition in the map properties of controlling the background color. Yes. And instead of white, I'll just choose this dark gray. Oh, yes. Okay, now when I zoom around, I don't get that abrupt flicker of a light white background behind my map. It's a more suitable tone for this map, so give that a look too. But man, isn't this cool? Blend modes. We're looking at Earth at night using an overlay blend mode atop imagery. I mean, look at how Russia, or I mean, uh, Moscow, Russia comes to life here. You can see all these tendrils of transportation hubs and settlements spindling out from these urban areas. It's really just a, a neat effect. Check it out. Okay, so one little tweak I can do here is in the layers, I'll open the properties for this earth at night layer. And let's say I want to kind of reduce that effect. I can just push its transparency down. So Layer level transparency, I'll push this down, you know, like 25%. Isn't that wonderful? Let's 
take a look at the shadow of the Himalayas, this beautifully, rather newly illuminated stretch of northeast India. Fantastic. And just for reference, one last time, I'll, I'll turn this layer off. So this is the regular underlying imagery base map. This is Earth at night with overlay turned on. And I'll just turn it off for you as a comparison. So blending mode instead of overlay, let's just set it back to normal. Boop. And bring its transparency back to zero. And you can get a sense for how cool blending modes are and what a big um, role they can play in your map. That's what I wanted to show you. Okay, give it a try. It's so easy. It's so fun. You can do cooler things than this. Have at it.